Please check out my GoFundMe for my 3DS capture card. A donation at any amount would be a big help, and if you can't donate, you can still help out by sharing this link on Twitter. Thanks! Hey, it's your friend CJ here, and this is our Week 7 battle for the PMC. Now, as you guys know, this would normally be on 3DS, but unfortunately Adam has been really busy this week and didn't have time to uh, prepare a team and get a gen in time, so just so we can meet the deadline for the week, we are going to do this on Showdown. That affords us the nice opportunity to do a live commentary, which we haven't been able to do for PMC since we don't have a capture card. Anyway, enough about that, let's look at this battle. He has his Mega Gyarados, his Rotom, Genesect, Latias, Regirock, and the Mamoswine. <coughs> um, definitely going to be a hard battle. I have, as you can see, have brought Manaphy, uh, Embor, Skarmory, Seismitoad, Whimsicott, and Jirachi. So, um, what could he lead with? It's really possible that he just leads with like his Rotom or the Genesect. As long as he doesn't lead Gyarados or Mamoswine, I think I'm comfortable leading... I don't know. I don't know what I want to lead. I do not know. I mean, I can U-turn out on a lot of his team, just not the Rotom. I'm just going to lead JS Pax. I think that's fine. Because he leads the Genesect. Now, do I think this thing is likely to be packing a Hidden Power Grass? I don't know. I do want to keep this thing for the Mamoswine and the Rotom. I can just go into my dedicated check for this thing, which is Embor, but he's probably just going to U-turn, which makes me kind of want to just stay in here and go for rocks. That's what I'm going to do. He goes for Energy Ball and I'm dead turn one. Cool. Well done, CJ. Now you have no answer for the Mamoswine or the Rotom. That's what I get. But uh, anyway, so now he can go into a lot of things. I think uh, I want to double. I don't know if he's choiced or not. Adam does like to bring choice Genesect. Hmm, tough decisions. Let's just go into his, so he's staying in. Okay, so he is packing the Psychic, so we're in kind of a crappy spot here. Energy Ball, Psychic, U-Turn, probably Flamethrower. This Genesect just really, really kills me. So it's presumably some sort of expert belt set. And he stays it again. Oh, I'm faster? Okay, well, that's fine. He's probably just going to get up some rocks here. As he goes into that. Cool. So I no longer have a switch into this. I do have Andre. So he's probably got to go into Gyarados now. If I were to assume. Ugh, I really wish I had just gone into the Embor. Or, uh, instead of sacking the Seismitoad. But what are you gonna do? Just maybe, hopefully I'll get like one kill this game. The nice thing is, is that if we can get rid of the Gyarados, and we can uh, get rid of the Latias, I think that we actually have a chance with our Jirachi. I think I'm kind of wishing a little bit that I had run uh, Iron Head over Meteor Mash, but the extra power should be nice. We let our Whimsicott take a lot of damage. He goes into Latias. 
I mean, he knows this thing gets Sucker Punch, so he wouldn't have brought this in unless he had a way to handle that. I'm gonna go Skarmory. Substitute Calm Mind Bolt Beam. I'm calling it now. He goes for Defog. Alright, fair enough. Um, so last time he brought in his Rotom on this thing. Uh, yeah, I really don't have an answer for that. And I should probably do a little calc to see if I can figure out how uh, offensive that thing is. Uh, yeah, that's my set. Rotom Heat. 50. So that seems... Seems like it's uninvested. So that's, that's good. At least I don't have to worry so much about that thing. If that's the case, then yeah, my, my Andre is my best answer for that. And does my, does my Jirachi outspeed it? Um, if it's 252 with a Timonature, which is, which is probably not, we do outspeed it. I don't really want to go into Manaphy, I just want to go into Embor. Yeah, which is what he does. So I do just click Superpower? I mean, it hits everything pretty hard on this team except for Latias. He might not necessarily go to the Latias, because there's no more hazards to remove. He just Volt Switches. I guess I clicked Iron Head expecting the Latias. But we'll see. Uh, Embor is also possible. Gyarados is also very likely. <coughs> Excuse me. If it is Gyarados, I didn't really have a, a great move to hit this thing. It gives the Latias. Okay, so we get off uh, some damage. I don't know if I would even call that a decent chunk. But, uh, so we would do about 50% to it with Sucker Punch. But I'm not quite ready to let this thing go down yet, since it's now my emergency check for Rotom. And I still would like to have it to defend upon the Genesect. So he makes a good prediction there. So let's cl click Skarmory. Yeah, that's us. We do take kind of a lot with a, from a Volt Switch. Um, yeah, I don't really want this thing to get weakened. I just don't have another switch in. So let's just do something crazy and just click Roost, because he's just going to Volt Switch. He's got to have some investment. Right? Because that did a lot. Unless you just got like a max, max, max roll. Alright, so now we go into... I'm expecting some sort of setup move here. We do have Whirlwind. Would we rather go for a Whirlwind? How much does a Mega Gyarados do? Um, not a ton. What about to my Whimsicott? That doesn't do a whole lot either. I, I'd rather save this thing, I think. He does stay in. He goes for the Ice Fang. Alright, fair enough. So we do outspeed this thing. I am just going to go ahead and click Toxic. 
That was a good prediction on his part. Well done, Adam. The thing that kind of sucks is I haven't worn down his team like at all. He does go for crunch. Let's go for U-turn. Crunch is going to do a lot as well. Really need to play around this thing. It does go for the Dragon Dance. Let's just Whirlwind. This will do a lot, but not that much. Yeah, we can deal with that. Okay, so this is this is what sucks. He's got to have the move. Okay, yeah, he does have Flamethrower. Cool. So is his last turn, last move U-turn? I mean, I'm not that worried about this thing, because I, I should be able to outspeed it with the Garth if I did outspeed it earlier with... What was it? With my Whimsicott. My Whimsicott's 147, and my Garth's 152. So I do outspeed that. So now the question is just what move do I want to go for here? Do I expect the Latias to come in, or do I expect the another thing to come in, like Gyarados or Rotom? Oh shoot, I forgot, I'm an idiot. I mean, he's got to know that I'm going for Power Up Punch here, right? Or not power up punch, but that I'm gonna outspeed him. Oh, that did nothing. Yeah, so I'm just at the point where I'm trying to get some kills. Yeah, and he's gonna be able to take us out after that. Yeah, uh, this is a, this is a lost cause. Adam made some very nice plays. And so just, you know, as of the time I'm recording this, uh, I don't know the results of Orso's match. So he definitely could be... Um, he definitely could have won, and if that's the case, then he's going to end up being the division winner. And that means I'm going to play Aki instead of Adam in round one. If it doesn't turn out to be the case, if he loses, then I think I still play Adam in round one. So this kind of sucks here. Because he can just waterfall twice and kill me. Let's hope that... So how much... So this did... So it's 140 and it did 26. Uh, this is 120 divided by 2 is 60. Okay, thanks Adam. I'm just gonna scald. It does kill. So I mean this thing had definitely has freeze dry. We'll see how much it does. Any scarf on top of that. Maybe uh, we'll get the burn, and we do, so we can take out the man bear pig, so that's nice. But I mean, he can just come in with Rotom, and it doesn't matter. So, somehow we escaped with a 3-0, which is way better than it could have been. Oh, okay, so he's just styling, I guess, because he can. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't matter. Like, he's gonna kill me. Yeah, I figured he would be Colbert Barry. Because he was worried about my Sneasel. So, good game, Adam. Uh, yeah, we'll see what Orso ends up doing. Um, if he wins and takes the division, I play Aki, like I said. And if he loses, we play Adam again in uh, week number two. That's why I wasn't really all that worried about this match. Um, but, but, you know, I'm, 
Adam, you're ridiculous. Um, you know, I, I don't want to take anything away from Adam. I uh, definitely think he played well. So I do want to thank you guys for watching. Please be sure to check back for more Pokemon content. And until the next time, I will see you guys later.